the busy metropolis of Houston, Texas. And that's where we're coming to you from tonight. Welcome, everyone. Let's get ready for some NBA basketball on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan joined by Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and on the sideline, David Aldridge. And the starting group for San Francisco. Williamson out there with LeBron James. And there's Bryant. Then it's Anthony Davis. And it's Doncic in at the point guard position. And for the Rockets. Westbrook and Harden, the dynamite pair. They're the backcourt. Robert Covington out there with P.J. Tuck. And it's House in at the small forward. Francisco starts out with the ball. Now Doncic. The pass to Kobe. Shot clock at five. And finish off by Bryant. Yeah, and if you're going to give Bryant a lane to the rim, then you deserve to get dunked on. You know how tenacious he is when penetrating inside. Now here's Westbrook. Here's Covington. Good D by Williamson. And you look at Robert Covington, first team all defense in 2018, the, the kind of versatile stopper that every team in the league could use. Some guys just understand how to generate points. He's one of them. Here's Westbrook. Zion Williamson making his last shot. Passes to House. Here is Harden. There's the triple. Anthony Davis grabs the miss. And Covington may be not a star, but he's a winning player. We've seen him. And the perfect example of that 3 and D role player can guard four or five positions and can definitely sling it from outside. Harden with it. Picked up by Kobe. A slow start here for Houston in this one. Six-point game. Westbrook against Williamson. And here's Covington from the arc. The Rockets with another miss. Three straight misses to begin this contest and already starting to look frustrated. From the arc, Doncic no good. And I think that one could have easily have fallen for him. Williamson kicks to Doncic. Good, and the assist goes to Williamson. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. And stolen by Williamson. The kick out to Bryant. Off target there. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. Here's Tucker. To the paint. Here's Westbrook. They need this. Good work defensively by Kobe. Oh my God, they can't buy one. 0 for 4. Sometimes this happens. Building up a big early lead, they have taken charge of this game. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. And Houston calls their first time out of the game. You know, even though LeBron doesn't go 100% every minute of every game in the season, GA, he still knows when to turn it on. And for someone at his age, that is something you have to know how to do. You can see when LeBron kicks it into that next gear. Can't keep it on all the time, but he's still able to take over when he needs to. The Rockets making a switch here. Gordon's checked in. San Francisco also with the sub. Honors checked in. And it's sent back by Bryant. No one near Westbrook as he lets it go. Off target with the open look. And Bryant slams it in. They had been excellent so far, coming in with a well-balanced attack. And it's helped them build an early lead. They just need to stay aggressive. Houston trails by 13. And Harden wide open. He shoots. And that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. And defensively, you got to respect Harden's ability to drive. That just makes him exponentially more difficult to guard out at the line. Well, they'll get another
a chance. LeBron outside. Shot clock at six. A second chance effort. And the layup is up and in. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. And it's Westbrook with the ball. He brings it up for Houston. Down by 12. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Luka Doncic. That's his first foul. Houston with a big group substitution here. Green, he's checked in for P.J. Tucker. Damari Carroll comes in for Robert Covington. Ben McLemore, he's checked in for James Harden. And it's Austin Rivers in for Russell Westbrook. One left to play in the first. The drive by Green. Here's Gordon. Off the left rim and out. San Francisco leading by 12. Here's Kobe. Come on, hold on! You got to buckle up on that one. And you can see their strategy coming in. They want to control the paint. This is my type of approach. Get some high percentage looks. Then later, you can play inside out. Here's Rivers. San Francisco making their last shot. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. I mean, he's extremely confident and aggressive. Rivers loves to take it up inside. Doncic looking it over. A rebound by Jeff Green. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Pass to Gordon. Let's it go from deep. No good there. And it's San Francisco the other way. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. And finish off by Bryant. And how about the vision there from Doncic? Can make the easy pass and also the difficult. And here's Gordon. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. <laughs> Houston shooting their first free throws. First trip to the line in this one. And that one misses. And he sinks the second. And San Francisco with possession. They're on a 19 to 6 run. Bonner dishes to Thompson. Traps in the tray. Sometimes before Thompson even catches the pass, he knows he's firing. Here's Rivers. Gordon with it. The Rockets again can't hit. And it's San Francisco in command with a 16-point lead as the buzzer sounds. And welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And what do you guys think about San Francisco so far in this one? Way to set the table. Offensively, they dominated on the interior. They came in looking to attack from the get-go, willing to be physical and setting the tone. Houston trails by 16. And stolen by Lillard. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. On the court right now for San Francisco. Clay Thompson is out there with Damian Lillard. Then it's Matt Bonner. Then it's Tatum. And it's Okoro in at the three spot. Outside Green. Rivers trying to get open. At three off the mark. San Francisco leading by 16. 
And he's going up for the alley-oop. A Kuro shot is off. Well, that alley-oop attempt, a case of what could have been, just didn't finish the play. You know, this is something you practice over and over again. I'm surprised they couldn't execute. Thompson passes to Lillard. No good on the three. And so it's Houston with it. Now here's McLemore. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Five on the clock. Pass to Carroll. The three. And it's San Francisco with the rebound. Down low. Up again. You have to remember, Thompson's grown up in a system where sharing the ball is emphasized. Now McLemore. And for everything this guy gives you on offense, Thompson has finally gotten his due as a defensive stopper. G.A., I don't think he still gets his due. He's still underrated, in my opinion. Yes, he made the all-defensive team in 2019. In addition to his offensive responsibilities, he has to guard the opponent's best score. Timeout call, the Rockets. Yeah, just looking to tighten up their defense in the paint. They've got to be better. It's a matter of want to. Helping out contesting shots, you have to want to make the effort. substitution here. P.J. Tucker, he's checked in for Green. Robert Covington comes in for Damari Carroll. James Harden, he's checked in for Ben McLemore. And Russell Westbrook subbed in for Austin Rivers. Westbrook kicks to house. Poked loose. Stolen by Okoro. Always going up for the alley-oop here. Hammers the alley-oop through. And his competitiveness showing through. That's an aggressive finish. He is just unwilling to settle. He gets right to the rim and makes sure they come away with points. Here's Westbrook. No points in the game yet for him. Puts one up from 19. And Bonner pulls it down. Bonner's got six rebounds in the game. Three-pointer Lillard. It's good from long range. And they're getting points. They're getting stops. And this is how they'd like to play all the time. Yes. When it's going good, it feels easy. These are the nights you relish. But they're tough to replicate. And here's Harden for three. Another miss by Houston. Well, they've been better than good on the glass today. And there is a glaring discrepancy between these two teams in that area. And if you look at this first half, overall, they've just had the better shot selection. What they have done is ran their plays all the way through until they get something they like. Stolen by Thompson. And the dunk by Tatum. An explosive player who has no problem finishing above the rim. Tatum does damage inside. Now a timeout called by Houston. Uh, let's see if coach can get them back on the right track. Because right now it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball. Checked in for Daniel House. San Francisco also changing it up. Zion Williamson's checked in for Jason Tatum. Bryant comes in for Okoro. And Luka Doncic subbed in for Clay Thompson. And with that one, he halts an 11-0 run by San Francisco. Here is Lillard. Williamson.
Williamson outside. Lost contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. San Francisco shooting their first free throw of the game. And Williamson's parents, both college athletes themselves, were a guiding force in helping him grow his game. When you're talking about growing his game, Greg, at an early age, Zion told his mom he wanted to be the number one player in college basketball. As a five-year-old, he played on an AU team for nine-year-olds. By age nine, he was waking up for 5 a.m. workouts. That's the kind of commitment it takes to succeed, even that early. They just won't miss. I mean, this is incredible. Good shooting can be contagious. You see the confidence running through this team right now. Here's Westbrook. Knocks down the 10-footer. Westbrook's got four this quarter. And it's the fearlessness of Westbrook. It's really refreshing to watch. When he's deep inside, he just goes right at you. He gets it in there. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Outside Gordon. 40 seconds left to play in the first half. Tipped away. Six on the shot clock. Loads it up for Williamson. Up high to stuff the alley-oop. Nearly unstoppable. No matter where the pass is delivered, Zion will go up and get it. 30 seconds left in the second quarter. Westbrook kicks to Harden. A three-pointer off the mark. In this first half, he has really fallen in love with the three. So far, not paying dividends. An emphatic LU jam. Well, now that they've settled into this game, you can see the offense is firing on all cylinders. Yeah, the reason why they made the adjustments they needed to make. They are executing. That's a two from Lillard. Puts up a three. Good, and the assist goes to Williamson. Lillard's got a pair of triples in the second now for San Francisco. And it's San Francisco with a huge 37-point lead to end the quarter. Their defense has been terrific in this game. We come back right after this. on the scoreboard the second half begins with very different goals for these teams one side trying to mount a comeback one side trying to protect their lead you look at Kobe Bryant in this game I mean he has been everywhere the burst he's had when going at the rim has been fantastic a lot of strong finishes through two quarters his activity level has made an impact and he is fearless well, we've got a second half of basketball for you. We think it's going to be pretty good. A big comeback, though, is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. Lillard's gone two for three from deep. Westbrook and Harden, the dynamite pair. They're the backcourt. E.J. Tucker is out there with Robert Covington, and it's House in at the three slot. They're the group for Mike D'Antoni starting the second half. And here's Davis for three. And again, it's San Francisco with a three. The assist totals, Kevin, just continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. Here is House. 
Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Westbrook against Doncic. On the wing, James shoots over Tucker. A shot, no good. And it's Houston the other way. Harden surveying the D. And his offense just hasn't been there. They keep calling his number, which is partly how they've dug this hole. And for everything that Anthony Davis does on the floor, you can't forget about his defense. Still an elite-level defender, guards multiple positions, and turns away a number of shots. Goes up at the stripe. Kept alive. And the pass to Tucker. That's going to be out of bounds. The Rockets will retain possession. You love the pressure he's putting on them. Almost had that steal. Fantastic anticipation. He has active hands. Even though he doesn't come away with the turnover, he's disrupting their offensive flow. Looking at who's out there now for the Rockets. Jeff Green. He's checked in for P.J. Tucker. Damari Carroll comes in for Robert Covington. And McLemore. He's checked in for James Harden. And it's Austin Rivers in for Russell Westbrook. Clock at four. Houston needs to get a shot off. Here's House. Lays it up and banks it in. At the end of the day, when the ball goes up, there's no substitute for effort. And San Francisco with possession. They've only allowed two points so far here in the second half. Doncic. That's in. Coming off the assist from Thompson. Doncic has got seven points in the game. And Davis gets a lot of blocks without getting in foul trouble. About a one-to-one -one ratio for him in his career. Uh, incredible. And he's done a great job of learning how to go straight up. Playing vertical. Gets blocks, but doesn't get pulled out of position. Does everything you want from a defensive anchor. Got a piece of it. And here we go. Fast break. Williamson's got it. And that one's good. Doncic. And wasting no time in transition, really pushing the pace. Doncic has gone 4-7 from the field here. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. You can tell Clay's played in an offense that emphasized spacing and ball movement. And taking care of the ball has been a problem for them. That's something they've got to fix. While the defense has been good, a lot of these turnovers have been unforced. Back to Rivers. Passes it to House. Five to shoot. Fires from the line. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. We've got 148 left to play here in the third. Doncic against Rivers. Let's a floater go. Now here's McLemore. He's covered by Thompson. Pass to House. And here we go. San Francisco fast break. Oh! Uh oh I tell you what, don't sleep on Tatum. He has some ups. And I love seeing him trying to electrify the crowd. 110 left in the third. Now here's McLemore. Tight defense on him. And Tatum over to help. Carroll with the three. And it's Clay Thompson with the rebound. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for San Francisco. Just four points. That's all they've given up here in the second half. Now, here's Okoro. Carroll covering. Just five on the clock. Doncic dishes to Thompson. A three-pointer, no good. Tatum kicks to Okoro. Buries it from three-point range. Okoro's got five now. A young guy with maturity, awareness, and a feel for the game. Tatum is special. And it's Jason Tatum with the foul. That's his first foul. Houston, a whole new five on the floor. So San Francisco going with almost an entire new group here. Matt Bonner, he's checked in for Zion Williamson. James comes in for Tatum. Kobe's checked in for Clay Thompson. And it's Damian Lillard in for Luka Doncic. 
We've got 22 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. And Westbrook, here we go. Got a hand on it. They get it back. Another block. Kobe with it. Lillard fires away from way outside. And at the end of the third quarter, a huge lead in this one may already have been decided. It's San Francisco as they end the third quarter on a 14-4 run. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get started for the fourth quarter. Well, we have the chance now, folks. Let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them and what a beautiful feat. Fundamental basketball. Keep your eyes up. Keep the ball moving. You're going to keep the defense on its heels. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same from the first three quarters. On the court right now for San Francisco, we've got Damian Lillard, Okoro out there with LeBron James, and it's Smith, and it's Davis in at the five down low. Not his best game, but they're still getting it done collectively. LeBron against Cephalosha. Chandler outside. Pass to Gordon. And it's San Francisco with the rebound. And here we go. Fast break. James has got it. Feeds it to Okoro. Here's Davis. He hits the back iron and sinks the shot. Davis has got the first field goal of the fourth quarter here for San Francisco. Now here's Gordon. 60 seconds off the clock here in the fourth. They grab their own miss. Here's Chandler. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. That one on Davis. Yeah, and Chandler, a difference maker defensively. The shot blocking, the controlling of the lane. He also gobbles up those rebounds. That free throw, no good. And some changes here for San Francisco. Carter, he's checked in for LeBron. And Georgia subbed in for a Coro. And he's good on the second. Fourth quarter still young, just over a minute play. Smith kicks to George. Trying to get open is Carter. They get the rebound. Left side, Davis. Lillard, the pass to George. Now Carter, three on the clock. That falls. Nice feed that time from George. From that in-between range, they've been the much better team. A little over a minute and a half of the fourth quarter gone now. Lobbed up there for Chandler. Stolen by Carter. And here we go. San Francisco fast break. George has got the ball. Insane move by Paul George. A high flyer who can create in midair. Now the Rockets with it. Game moves along. Two minutes gone here in the fourth. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And after over a decade with the Thunder, last season, Russell Westbrook starting fresh with the Rockets. A superstar pairing with longtime friend James Harden. And Russell Westbrook drops them both. And Greg, there were some legitimate questions about Harden and Westbrook and how they would play together. Westbrook not the floor spacer they looked to put around Harden. And that preceded their moves at the trade deadline. I mean, committing to small ball. Westbrook, the lone non-shooter from distance, Unlocked though to attack the paint and an intentional foul right there Really no idea why you're fouling in a situation like that. You know, maybe there's some bad blood between those two Looking at who's out there now for the Rockets and McLemore. He's checked in for Gordon and it's Rivers in for Russell Westbrook Rivers dishes to McLemore Back to Rivers and 
too much time in the lane, they get called for the three-second violation. And it's easy to give up after a play like that, but this team needs to keep fighting. It's just one trip down the court, but you have to have short memory in this league or you won't last long. Lillard from outside. It's rebounded by Houston. Now Rivers. Jacks up a three. The Rockets again can't hit. And so it's Carter who brings the ball up for San Francisco. Oh, the power on that throwdown! Goodness. Slippery play by Paul George to get inside. He ends up right where he wanted to be for the shot. And here are the Rockets now. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. And so it's San Francisco with it, and San Francisco with possession. They're on an 11 to 3 run. Shot clock reset for San Francisco. Smith for three. The shot, no good. So far, we've seen them be a bit careless with the ball. Simply put, out of control is how they play thus far. They're going to have to reel it in and show some more discipline. Here's Lillard, and Damian Lillard throws it down hard. Beautiful find by Carter. Sees the floor really well for a young big. 125 left in the fourth quarter of this one. McLemore, the pass to Rivers. Back to McLemore. With some arc. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Rivers has gone only one of five shooting from the floor. Smith drives in, and he makes good on the layup. Smith's got his first points in this one. If you play JR for the jump shot, he's also capable of putting it on the floor and driving it right past you. Chandler outside. And Chandler throws it down. Wow, flying high and throwing it down with the one hand. Woo, one of his favorite moves right there, guys. And a deep three from Lillard. Sinks it. What range from outside. Wow. And we've seen Lillard hit that shot before. He has no fear when it comes to the deep three. Here's McLemore, and denied. He sends it right off the glass. And George with the stuff. Inspired tonight. They fought hard and at crucial points just made the plays. Especially during this last run, which ultimately put the game away. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Rivers kicks to Cephalosha. And the wing jumper offline. And I'm sure next time he sits down, coach is going to have a few choice words for him with that shot selection. And you know what? He knows it. You have to try to play within the system or you're going to come away with empty possessions. Smith for three. Misses there. And so it's San Francisco winning this one. To come into an opponent's building and dominate the way they did tonight says, I think, Greg, an awful lot about this team. Yeah, I, I guess they don't need home cooking to feel at <laughs> home. I mean, Kevin, just a masterful performance all the way around. And that'll do it, folks. Now for Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA here on 2K Sports. See you later.